guys, it's Amaki here. Since the um, last little showing of um, our little city, it's now, it's actually called Arigai. Yeah, we had no clue how to pronounce it at first, but you know, oh, got some lag going. Yeah, so um, we're just looking around and basically that they're the banners that we've got. We just thought if we're going to make a city, you got to have a banner at least to show it off a bit. So you had, um, with all the new upda all these updates and stuff, I keep not updating the texture packs, but I'm on ovos at the moment. If I had John Smith's, then the wool would look a lot better together. Well, that's my opinion. But I'll just show you around, really. Because we've actually started upstairs and downstairs, but we still need to sort all this lobby part out. I got a little bit of lag, it's quite annoying. But anyway, so here's, um... The uh, main area. This is where you come in. That's ba that's basically my house, Fumblemore. That's basically my name on it. And there's Orcs, which is Kieran. Yeah, I don't know. He's not even on his computer at the moment, so uh, that's why he's not on it. Uh, otherwise, would have got him to do this with me. So I'll just show you about the city again. I know you've seen a lot of it, but we have started uh, over here. Basically, I can't take any credit for this castle over here because. I haven't um, done, I actually haven't done one bit of that, but I have been gi giving him all the cobblestone, because all that I remove underground he uses to make this. So basically, I helped him cut down all the trees to get the um, wood to do these platforms, trust me these platforms are huge. Nicer, uh, I don't really know why one tree is bigger than the other, but ah well. All, all, everything you can see on these two platforms, Kieran built all of it, other than the, uh, well he did a lot of the uh, platform as well, but I thought I'd help him out since they were huge. Uh, I, I know NPCs aren't on, so I don't know, I think these are supposed to be like shops, yep, uh, less shop, rank guy. Like most of the houses, we haven't put much, nothing in. We haven't exactly put stuff in them because it's like, what's the point? Because no one's going to be living in them yet. But yes, so after all the time it took to create this city, and then I started talking with like the leaders and stuff to see what's happening, I now have got us protected, and in this city is now part of the Orc Kingdom. So, uh. Basically, if you want to visit it, guys, um, saying that I should really show you the way to the uh, city. I'll, I'll do it. Saves, um, you know, he's not knowing. Basically, we need to get more stuff, as in, because we, we need to put another banner up there. But see, I've basically actually not seen this tower myself because I've been on the ground doing all my building. But uh, let's go check it out. Oh, but I know this this won't be saying this is like a little water supply for him to get water like he's been doing with the fountains See it looks nice The castles uh, got a weird little shape, but it looks better than having it straight up I would have probably done it straight up knowing me The door part here these are for the um You know like pistons the little retractable doors whatever you call them The fact that we've only just started this part here just means that this is gonna actually gonna have to be huge the rest of this platform part there and then we'll have to get even more of it protected since basically all the part that we've done at the moment that's all protected so oh crap where am I where is he what there oh wait please say that didn't hurt oh it did a little bit well basically you that base from the last part of the city that's all that's been done. We do have a couple of houses for people to stay, but we don't exactly have the commands to do the houses. It's so like we have to it's a legit thing, but we do have commands now, but the commands are for the city is in if we want to add members into our city then we can. But adding members into the city basically you can then remove blocks and stuff like that. And so basically if you don't if you're not a member of the city, you actually cannot do anything other than walk about. So that helps because now a lot of the griefers are getting banned but more are coming in, so I'll just um I'll show you what I've been doing underground. Cause 
It's not it's not much because I only started it last night and I've been trying to do my single player but with all these updates it's getting the single player commands which aren't out yet. So yeah. I won't really show my city life today because I have done I've actually done quite a lot on it, but as in um with all the updates I've not done a huge great. Well, this leads to all our strip lines. Yeah, I may as well show you my strip lines. I don't know. Basically, at first, I just dug out all of this pit. It leads down there. But what I did then was... Um, I just thought, let's make it more... Whoa, whoa, I'm sure I've walked past this. Stupid. But I thought, I'll make it more organised. It's down this one. So, but as soon as you enter this part here, it's where all my strips come in line. If I'm correct, there's about 20 of them. Well, that one's not been lit up. I'm not going to count them, but basically there's loads of these. This is where we get all our, um, what's it called? Can I get that? Oh, no. But basically, well, basically, you can't dig down very deep in the wild where we are. But since we've got it protect protected, our protected area, we can dig a further down. But this part here is not protected because it's bloody gone way, it goes way out of this here. But there's a lot of strips there. So I'll just go to where I'm actually building my... Because I'm going to start like... If you've played the server you'll know the dwarfs have a massive underground. But because I'm an orc and my friend's an orc. We're trying to get both like building... How would you say it? Both building styles together. So I'm starting building underground. So what... Well I didn't... Kieran had already started strip mining down here, as in, so basically he stri started strip mining here. But what I do is, every all, all the stuff I remove, I put the cobblestone in there, but since it's been on, he's took more. So, see, we're just getting loads loads of more stuff, like I've got all these iron pickaxes from all this, so. As a, uh, I don't, I did that just for a bit of decoration. And you see in the walls, this is just a, like a water, supply again like I'm gonna end up changing all the gravel and stuff cobblestone in the walls to make it look to normal so or something but this is what I've I've, I've started digging underground it, as in I need a lot of light so I'm just like eh, just marking out where I am and because I'm extending the roof I'll show you up here come on because I'm extending the roof I can't reach from the floor so I've had to dig up here and I've got a little walkway and I'm making it even higher up, basically. Oh, more cobblestone. Must have lagged. Yeah, because cause it's a server, it, you can lag. And they do have to restart start that quite a lot. But with me, like, I, with me doing all this, like, I died about 10 minutes ago. Because you have hunger and you need to eat just to stay alive. But it does take quite some time. Like, because I died several minutes ago. Let me, let me check. Look, I'm 20% hunger now. So it's like it finally does go back up. So what I'm doing is I'm digging all this out and gonna start create like a sort of underground thing, more houses, etc. For when uh, people want to stay, because I'm when we can get the command thing to add regions inside this region. This region is our basically set our city. So when we can get regions inside that region, we can like set houses up for people so others can't rob the stuff which is what we want because let's be honest you don't want everything you've been doing to be robbed so basically I'll show you the way from spawn if you wanna uh, see these were basically more houses but anyway I'll show you the way from spawn so I'll, I'll just kill myself wait I'll put all the stuff in the chest makes more sense I'm not dying with all this on me um, how could I kill myself how could I kill myself I'll drown myself, yeah. Basically, like, this bit will get removed, but it's just for storage now, so when Kieran needs uh, cobblestone, here it is. See, as uh, we, we're getting there, we're getting there. It's like getting better and better, but it does still take time since legit. I don't get as much city life done since I'm doing... Um, since I'm doing this as well as City Life, because this this server's fun, man. I just like doing it. And since it's me, I don't really build legitly a lot. As in, I don't use MC Edit to build because I only use that to flatten land for my City Life. Oh. So then, 
I have single player commands basically to um, I have single player commands to um, what's it called? Yeah, come on, my man's mine. Just, just to spawn stuff basically, and for fly. That's about it. So basically, these guys have all died, and now I have to wait. I think it's five minutes before I can spawn. So basically, when I died, I seen a lot of these in here before. But I'll, uh, I just end this. I just end this now, and then come back when the um, when I've spawned again. Be right back. Well, guys, I'm back. I have just spawned, and this is the Temple of Aegis, if I've got this right. Basically, that in the corner there, that's Ax. He's um, an NPC, not NPC, um, he's an admin, GM, whatever you want to call him. So, he's one of the main guys. Basically, I've got F1 pressed so you can't see people's names. Look, so these are actual people who are chatting, role playing, etc. So, this is where you spawn. So this is basically the way to Arikai from spawn. I'm not sure if there's actually a path to the Orc Kingdom from here, but basically it's close, nah, nah, close to the Orc Kingdom. So you can, like, if I were to destroy something now, this is basically being protected, watch. This is, like, if you do not my city and you're not a member, this is what happens, look. You don't have permission for this area because it's all protected and you're not a member of it because you can't be a member of spawn unless you're a GM and then you know you can build etc you, you are not there it is Aegis I'll just uh, press F1 so you don't get all the uh, people chatting etc right dum, da, dum. see I would have um, left you from spawn I was well, like just it's like I think it's five minutes in spawn but I don't know, it's just be a waste of time really, it's just uh, watching me do nothing in spawn etc, because it's only small. Basically this is the Orcs Arena, if we go load up. Looks like it looks good, so I may as well let it load up. Come on. Come on. Ah, basically because I've got quite a few things up at the moment, I'm lagging. Ah. Some of the stuff around here I haven't seen, because I don't die that often, so... Come on. Oh, I'm gonna have to go closer to it for it to come up a thing or it's just not gonna let me well here we go I have to go into it bloody hell this lag is something I don't like this is the orcs arena basically they have another one which is huge I think it's an, this I know this is an arena and I think they have a bigger one which is in the air which looks great I've not been in there because since it's me I'm a dwarf I will most likely die be well, I th I, I'm probably allowed in the Orcs here, but, um, as in, because I've got a house around there, because even though I'm a, I'm a different race, I sp um, spoke to one of the big guys and just to see if I can uh, have a house there, because all I do is, um, I have chests there, so, it, but when, um, before it was protected, people used to grieve us a lot, rob our stuff, so, I just used to put it all here, there, just so um, it was protected. Oh. Oh. So basically, this is the way. As you can see, you can start. I think if yeah, you can start seeing it. So it's basically a straight line after you turn on yourself from spawn. So if I was to go down there, then that'd lead to my um, little house where it's protected. But basically, I'd like to show you it from a distance, but I really want to know why it's not loading up. It's quite annoying. Cause like there's the tower I built and there's my little house there and behind there's Kieran's little house. So it's like it looks really good from afar and if I was to go on top of that hill it looks really big. We had started a little path but yeah we haven't like exactly finished it because um you know we wanna use we we, we want to use all the cobblestone we get at the moment on our main sir because well not sir the um, main building. I'll just give you a last uh, little look from the side, and then um, I'll be. Uh, I may as well end it because it's, it's going to be like 20 minutes, and uh, yeah, I, I don't have Sony Vegas or anything that makes a file size is small when rendered in HD. So uh, yeah, they t even for like so basically the files which are like 15 minutes end up about 1.8 gig or something. That's like a four hour bloody download just for a small video, so it's uh, it's annoying really. Because I, you know, I want Sony Vegas and stuff, but I don't know what it is, it just, I don't, I don't when I've tried to get it, it hasn't worked on my PC. 
So, uh, I don't know, my PC isn't like bad, it's not got like bad specs, but... See, look at this, from this size, the city looks huge. The wall's only small, but we'll end up making it bigger. The, night, the trees give it a nice little effect. It's the plat like all the platforms have got little um, pillars below them to make the effect a lot better, as in making that the structure. And right at the back, you can see the castle, which we're going to. Well, Kieran will probably will probably carry on doing that while I carry on doing what I'm doing downstairs, grabbing him cobblestone, etc., etc. So yeah, that th that's the uh, Lord of the Craft server, really. And this is Arikai. So. Seriously, I reckon you should check this out. So basically, since you know the way from spawn, I would suggest come up by. If you just want to be a member of our city, help build. You know, speak to us in the game. If you want to know my name on the game, it's... I'll just say hello in here, so... Uh, hello. That's my name, Fumblemore, co-leader of Arikai. And Kieran's is our co-leader of Arikai. So that's our name, so, you know check us out and hope to be seeing you all Arikai soon so bye